Uh, one of my spies was out, well, Crafty, um, went to see Chicago the Musical uh, last night, and she said she really, really, really enjoyed it. It's a whole new theatre at the moment. I've got the programme in front of me. She did say she really enjoyed the dancing, there's a lot of bottom wiggling. Now, I don't think you see that. On, you know when shows get reviews and five stars and four stars and things like that? I don't think on a West End billboard or indeed outside Whole New Theatre there, there is a, a, a critic's little quote, crafty BBC Radio Homicide, there's a lot of bottom wiggling in it. Let's confirm with two of the stars of the uh, show. Ali Baston, who plays uh, Roxy Hart, and, uh, and Tupeli Dorgu, who's uh, Velma Kelly. Uh, morning to you both. Thank you very morning. much for coming in. Thank you for having us. Uh, is, is there a lot of... Uh, it, it's some very beautiful bottoms. Is that, yeah, <laughs> yeah, so yeah. I'm told. Yeah. Is, is that the sum of Chicago the musical? Does that sum it up? There's Pretty a, much. There is a lot of bottom too, wiggling in it. too many clothes on, take some off, and then right. just do a bit of shaking and shimmying and right. wiggling. <laughs> Yeah. And then you're there, uh, there's, you're in. There's, there's got to be more than that. And a whole this is, lot of jazz. Yeah, yeah a lot of yeah. jazz hands too. Yeah, because this is, this is a hugely successful show, isn't mm. it? 15 yeah. years, I think it's been going. Right, OK. You don't look old enough to have been in it 15 years, to Pelly. How no. long have you been in it? I've been in it a week. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, how's it gone? Um, it's been really good. We opened in Bradford last week. Um, and obviously Hall was our first night last night in Hall. Yeah. Um, it's been going really well. The cast are great. Everyone gets on. And um, yeah, it's you know it's 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 strange when you kind of rehearse a show, you get to a certain point, and then you start putting it on stage and in costume, and then all of a sudden it's like a whole other world of yeah. madness um, and things. But it's been great. You know, we're really enjoying it. It's oh. such a great show. Like this, it's got fantastic script. The characters are so well put it, it together. Expl explain the show because didn't um, the, the Welsh woman married to Michael Douglas play it in the film Chicago? She did. Catherine Zeta Jones. I, I was getting there. Thank you. You've, you've, you've helped me out <laughs> yeah. there. You've helped, you've helped me out. Ex yeah. Explain that. So the, it's the based plot, on the, two um, yeah. murderesses, Velma and Roxy, and right. um, they've basically off their lovers and their husband, like do, husband. Do, does this come naturally to the pair of you? Have you? Well, we, you, you know, you we have any trouble with it. Yeah. Yeah. There's no kind of just, you know, difficulty. We just go, mm, you've annoyed me, bang. I'm slightly <laughs> worried yeah. about this. I played a murderer in my last job as Did well, you? I think. <laughs> yeah. Obviously something slightly sinister. Just going, hold on a minute. Me. She who cracks the whip, can I have a bit of security in the studio? I'm, I'm, <laughs> slight, I'm slightly worried about oh, these don't two. Don't be afraid. <laughs> be very afraid. Hand. Be very afraid. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah. So it's, it's going well. How long have you been in it? Uh, same. We opened um, in Bradford last week, so we've been going about ten days, uh -huh. and we were rehearsing for about a month. So um, it's just kicking off for us now, and I'm just absolutely loving it. It's like Tapelle was saying, we've got fantastic company. Um, we're like, we've you know all really bonded. We're like family already, which is so important when you're touring around. And I think it kind of comes across on stage from what people have said that uh -huh. you know. With, there's such good chemistry between everybody. Mm. Is this a physically demanding yes, part? Yes, in play? a way. <laughs> a musical, yeah? Yes. Yeah. Um, it is, it's, um, it's, uh, it's very much for the ensemble. Um, they do kind of quite a lot of numbers sort of back to back. And mm -hmm. then um, they all sit on stage at the side. So they don't have time to kind of stretch and kind of warm down, warm up. And then they right. kind of just go bang into another number. For us, we have our own numbers as well. And there is, with Fosse, it's very specific it's very much about just body still moving a finger or it's moving a shoulder or moving a hip and just trying to do that and not move anything else is really difficult and that's what actually causes so much stress hold, within hold, your body hold, hold on a minute <laughs> moving a finger no finger. honestly because there's so many different ways you can do it and there's only one way to do it right right so there's things like that that you that's you know holding yourself in the posture and that kind of thing and learning the style getting into your body is difficult so yeah there's um it, there's there's quite a lot and we they are quite energetic numbers mm -hmm. um so yeah, it's uh, it is kind of kapow all it singing is, yeah, and dancing, it is very much high energy. Like you get on the train at the uh -huh. beginning of the for us at the beginning of the show, and yeah. that's it. It's sort of hard and fast for two hours. It's a, uh, it's it's full on. And there's no kind of excess in the show. There's not kind right. of oh we could have cut that speech down by five minutes, or it's just waffle. You know, some plays you might see, or some shows you kind of think oh not another number, but the mm -hmm. number is introducing something or telling a story, and there's no dialogue that doesn't need to be there. So, so it's all there. there. There is absolutely there is no fat in it, in, no, in, including no. any other cast. Yes. I'm told <laughs> all these pert bottoms. Totally, it just goes bang 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 from beginning to end. I can't, but it's Crafty's fault. She's out there it's nodding not just away. About no, I'm, I'm, I know it's not. No. Uh, 
<laughs> Some arms and legs going on there as well. <laughs> she who cracks the whip is just offering me a cold shower rather than security. <laughs> um, how, 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 and the singing's great, says Crafty. She's just buzzed in me. As how, how long are you in the new theatre? How long's the run? Um, till Saturday. Right. Two shows on Friday and two on Saturday, and then one every other night. Okay. So how are you enjoying the area? Because you're you're in different places, yeah. aren't you? Yeah, Ali, where, I'm you're, staying you're, in the centre of town, okay. and it's fantastic. Like great. I'm loving the shopping. That's a bit lethal when you're on tour. Actually, <laughs> you're loving the shopping. Yeah, yeah. you end up See, pootling go. around in the day a uh-huh. little bit because obviously we don't start work until the evening. Um, I am sleeping like a teenager a little oh, bit. At the moment, yeah, just acclimatizing. <laughs> so I sort of surface about lunchtime, go for a wander around the shops. Um, but no, it's great, great new massive shopping mall. Mm-hmm. You've not been here before? No, never been to Hull before. Okay, so what do you reckon? It's lovely, and lots of good um, museums and things, apparently. So I'm going to do some ex- exploring. I've got my dog with me as well, so oh, I'm doing some nice right, dog walks. Out walking, and yeah, it's, it's a good city to walk. You can walk down the river. Tupelo, have you ever been here before? Uh, no, I don't think I have. And I know Hull Truck's up here, and I've, yeah. I've always wanted to work at the theatre and go and see something but I don't think I'll be able to now I'm in a show yeah. <laughs> unless I just take the night off just to go and no, see no, something no you can't do that seriously unpopular you can't throw a city no you can't do that so, um, but, you, but you're staying the other side of the river right? I'm staying in Grimsby and uh-huh. Scartho actually with right. uh, friends of mine um, posh. Mark and Kathy and their Grimsby. little kids Scarf yeah. and Jack so hello to them if uh, they're listening um, and it's lovely where they stay and I you know it's lovely it's a treat for me because I'm staying with quite a few friends on the tour that you don't right. get to see often uh-huh. but then you go and you bombard them for a week and then they, they see enough you're meant to be working, not going on a mate's tour. I know, it's like a massive jolly. Yeah. 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 Getting paid you're for meant them. to be grafting hard. <laughs> I, 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 what, have you no friends, Ali? Then? No is that friends, what it is? apparently. Just my, she has me a dog. And my dog. A dog. Yeah, it's my little sidekick. Right. <laughs> so we're touring. So, so we're who looks traveling. after the dog when, when you're doing your stuff? She hangs every out night. in my dressing room, right. um, but she's become the sort of company mascot. So every, she's getting so much love, and she's got many new uncles and aunties now oh, in the company. Lovely. So I everybody's a different walking out. I like, know. Look at you with the dog. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. dog. You never walk your own dog anymore. <laughs> yeah. no, everybody sort of takes turns looking <laughs> after her, so they're really helpful. Can I ask you a question? Just uh, something we were talking about today. Vivian Westwood says, well, uh, as, as, as a nation, you know, with the, the standard of dress is, is appalling, apart from 70-year-old women. You two look very stylish, by the way, I have oh, to really? say. I'm what? dressing like a foreign that. exchange student at the moment, <laughs> yeah, because yeah. I've got a suitcase full of random clothes. I'm, I'm not wearing a jacket and a, a check shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard knowing what to put together, because you pack for a couple of weeks. Like, most of us are going home next week, so we're in South End and we'll commute from London. Right. So you think, do I pack for one week, two weeks? Then you get all this clobber, and most of it's in the back of my car. No, right. And then, because nothing goes with anything, so I'm like, well, I'm going to wear that with that. It is a bit much, but going back is to she what... Right, Vivian Westwood, is she on the money or not? Says, I think it depends on... Some people in different areas of the of the country dress differently, but I yeah. do think everyone has a sloppy side and then a dressed-up side. On, in the day, honestly, I'm like, Ali says, foreign exchange, it's just kind of mishmash, yeah. all sorts of what have you got on. What's but if I'm going out, today? it'll be kitted out properly. Uh, what, what have you made of the style up here in Hull and Grimsby? I then? haven't have you... seen that much, to be honest, because I'm I've not really been out in Hull yet. Do you know what? Oh. I quite like thinking about it in fashion at the moment, though. I think it's so eclectic uh-huh. mm-hmm. and more than I've ever seen it before. And a real mis- you know, some people into their vintage stuff of 70s, 80s, mm. 90s. You know, I've seen everyone, like, everyone's running around in Doc Martens. Like, I used yeah. to have a pair of those. Yeah. Yeah. The girls in the oh my God, have got them I think now. they're old enough are now to see things they coming back around again. They look so cool. Just, just plain black ones or colour ones? Girls red. got black and one's got cherry red. I had the cherry red ones when I was at school. I always wanted them, but I got the shoes instead. They're just not. Cool. Actually, I not, had the shoes. Not, <laughs> yeah, not, the not, as, not cool. as cool at all. Well, well, you, two, you, you two look fantastically cool. Um, all the best with Chicago. Thanks, thank, thank you thank ever you. so much for Thanks coming for in. Us. It's thank quite all right. It's, uh, it's at uh, Whole New Theatre, and there is much more. Ah! Oh. Is, that, oh, is that your dog? Really? She's yeah. that, she's that, having a cuddle. Oh, right. oh, she's with, so with, with redders. Oh. Yeah. And I don't, I'm not even sure whether redders like dogs, but there you go. They've uh, bonded now. Well, uh, so much more than bottom wiggle. That can't be, your, uh, that can't be the last line well, on this. Chicago Say something musical. else. Say something else. All right, it's fantastic. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's a great night out. You Definitely. will not be disappointed. Yeah. You will be uplifted. It's very funny as well. And very funny. Chicago the musical. very funny. <laughs> <laughs> a, a whole new theatre till Saturday. It's it, really nice of you to come in. Thank, thank you. you. Thank That's you great. Very much. And uh, enjoy the area. Enjoy Hull and Grimsby. Cheers. Uh, thank thank you. you very much. We're going to go to Lydia.